Hey guys, Chronic here. Just a little bit of information for everybody. I have recently become a VB Audio brand ambassador, and that allows me to have a discount code for all of you guys. So if you ever do decide to purchase uh, any of uh, VB Audio's products, anything like that, if you choose to use my coupon code, you can save 15% on your entire cart, as well as help me out. It would be greatly appreciated, yo. Anyway, on to the video. Hey there guys, Chronic here, and today we're going to be showing you how to use voice meter to bring high quality audio into VR chat. So the first thing you're going to want to use or do is download voice meter, uh, the EXE version. Hit install, put that to your desktop, hit save. Alright, so this one already has administrative privileges, so run this. Okay, so you come up with something like this, actually, uh, minus all the customization. So your first step of things would be to open your sound control panel. So that would be MMSYS.CPL. You're going to want to type that in your, your start button. You're going to want to click the control panel item. So your primary headphones, the things that you use as like your primary your primary speakers, you're going to want to hit properties, you're going to want to hit advanced, and you're going to want to take a close look at this format. This format is what you're going to want to change everything to. So every cable, every everything like that. So cable A, properties, advanced, See, 24, oh my god, okay. Okay, 16, 48, okay. I th so we're just going to want to go around and change all this to 16-bit 48,000. Just make sure everything is at 16-bit 48,000. This is a good, good example, actually. These are cables, indeed. Boom, yes. 16-48,000. It's very tedious work, but if you don't do this, you get unnecessary popping, crackling. Uh, yeah, you, you, yeah, we're just better off doing this. And this thing we just did here, I'm going to want to do that exact same thing in the recording tab. You hate me right now, I know, but... You're gonna want to do it just for just for sake and just for the sake of the trouble. Sixteen bit, forty-eight thousand. Okay, the, so the microphone we fixed all this to the proper settings. So again, cable A properties, bot two channel, sixteen bit, forty-eight thousand DVD quality. Apply. Okay. 
Properties advanced 16 bit 48. Oh, we're gonna okay, okay. Properties advanced 16 bit 48. Apply, okay. Cable D, same thing. Going through the works here. Um, 48,000, all right. Now, after you uh, engage in personal, I'll say, I'll say, From DK, uh, this is being used, okay, what, okay. This is your aux, okay, okay. 16, 48,000, okay, okay. Couple more to go here. 16, 48. Uh, 16, 48. Oh, we'll also cancel that. And that's it for this part here. So after you're done, you're gonna wanna hit re So after you're done, you're gonna wanna hit the restart audio engine here like that. Then you are going to want to confirm everything is the same by going into system settings and just checking. Okay, so 48,000, 48, 48, 48, 48, 48, 48 across the board. And just make sure the preferred main sample rate Again, 48,000. Okay. <clears throat> so that's it for this. Okay, we need to do a couple more things. So cable. This is the one, okay, okay, this is the one, okay. Uh, control panel, okay. So you're gonna wanna open the control panel of your cables and any anything like that. And you're going to want to uh, put an internal sampling rate. That is that is stupid high, um, I, okay. So the sampling rate, we're also gonna wanna match the internal sampling rate to each of these. So VB cable cable A to all the cables, right? Okay, I don't get why that's ninety six thousand, but we're bringing that down to forty eight thousand. Okay, and we're just doing the same thing for my cable B right quick. No, we already no control panel. Ah, that's the one. Internal sampling rate, 48,000, okay, okay. Now after you're done all of that, you're going to want to restart your computer one more time. And uh, we'll see you when you get back. All right, we are back and we are going to want to make sure your microphone is selected on your hardware input one preferably use MME uh, on hardware input one make sure a3 is selected on a3 make sure cable B is selected uh, on your hardware out and a1 make sure your headphones or speakers wh whatever it'll it'll be speakers if it's plugged into your headphones make sure it's clicked Now you're going to want to hit sound mixer options up. You're going to want to hit this up. You're going to want to find voice or sorry, VR chat and you're going to want to force it to use voice meter aux that will start showing up here in this virtual input. Now, if you're coming across if you're coming across an issue where that is not happening, try changing the default output to aux input. Same with the input. Change that to cable B. We are working with cable B. You are also going to want to make sure A1 is checked on anything you want to hear. So you're going to make sure A1 is checked on the game and you're going to make sure A1 is checked on the music if you want to hear it. A3 is going to be checked on anything else you want anyone else to hear. Obviously, you don't want to hear yourself, so you don't have A1 checked on your microphone. You want people to hear you, you have A3 checked on your microphone. Use that logic for everything. Now, in-game, you are going to want to make your microphone use cable B as well. So you're going to want to go here. You're going to want to go to cable B. There it is. Find cable B in the list of outputs. Select that, and you should be hearing yourself in here now. 
Uh, you can do basic adjustments, volume up, volume down. Oh boy, uh, that you heard that. I am so sorry. Um, denoiser is very nice. Uh, gate is very nice. Um, if you're interested in learning what any of that is, I'll be providing documentation down below for you to look into. Um, now, uh, to get the music to go through is pretty much the same. So, so sound mixer options. Uh, sound mixer options. Okay, it loaded this time. Change Spotify to an input. So we're going to use cable input. Um, we have on voice meter cable output, we're going to want to select cable output, bada bing, bada boom, and when we select A3 with the music, we're going to turn that right down though, oh, buddy boy, okay, actually we can just turn that down on my side, so once we hit A3, we'll notice that you guys can hear it. But we'll also notice that in game can hear it now. So that's been this tutorial on uh, that's been this tutorial on how to set up voice meter to use in uh, VR chat. Thank you all for watching. Uh, if you've learned something, please leave a like, maybe subscribe, maybe even check out my Ko-Fi down below. Be greatly appreciated. A lot of work and research has went into doing a lot of these tutorials I've been doing. Uh, yeah, have a good day. Peace out, guys.